If you would like to get your song reviewed, dear listener, there's the filthy capitalist option. It sorry says. 125 gets you straight to the head of the line. You don't have to be a part of the alliance. You don't have to be part of the group. Wait a minute. And the biggest thing is you don't have to wait. You have to skip and jump right in front of everybody. 125 gets you there. You do that three times and then get mashed down to the $75 rate for perpetuity. Yes! Also, there is a band review option. <laughs> so if you've got a band and you're trying to get your band some exposure, hit me up at sorry at gmail.com and I'll show you the details about how to pull you that off. You can also jump on Patreon and there is a option on the tiers to be able to get your band reviewed. Yep. Obviously, we can't lie to you. So we can't guarantee, can't guarantee a positive a review. Positive review. <laughs> get what you get. It's just rubbish. 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 That's British for garbage. Ah! My favorite is a community option. One dollar at the gate gets you in a Patreon. You get to join an alliance. The alliance joins their points together, and that helps determine what songs that we do. <laughs> the alliances hang out on Discord. Message me on Patreon to get the link. And they do all kinds of other cool things. They do Minecraft. What? Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah, yeah. It's really a community within the community. Anybody can go on the village, facebook.com backslash Vin and Sorry. There's 160 plus thousand people on the channel. What's cool about the Discord is that it offers a real opportunity for community connection, friendship, that type of thing. But, and uh, it's on Discord, so if you're not a Facebook person, it's for you. You start off at a dollar. Right. Plus you get exclusives. Sorry and I are working on a song. So the first 15 seconds of that was on Patreon. Also, at $15 tier and above, when we actually debut the video, they're going to be there live with us. There you are, dear listener. Buy our merch. Buy our merch indeed. A child shall lead them. To buy our merch. Yes, dear listener. Yes, dear listener. Yes, dear listener. We are on Insomnium next. The, the last, last statement. statement. Now, Insomnium, I got to tell you guys. I think you're wrong, Ben. I'm pretty sure you're the one that got me on to Insomnium. You're not the first one that got me an Insomnium song, but I'm pretty sure I became an Insomnium fan because of you. Mm. So when I heard Insomnium was on the list, I was like, holy shit, Insomnium is on the list. <sighs> so I'm pretty happy. Okay, now is the time for a couple songs from Insomnium to close out our night. Remember, dear listener, we are in Mellow Death Monday. We are. People can be like, oh, actually, it's actually, it's Wednesday. Well, actually, in uh, California, it's still Tuesday. So that means it's Mellow Death Monday. That's true. So we made it. Yay! <laughs> All right, let's check this one out. In some Having the said last... that, now is the time. This one is from their 2006 album, Above the Weeping World, track seven, the last statement. Here we go. The last statement, track seven on the album, track five on this show, Insomnium, DJ Ben, let's do it.
explain don't forget me at the end? Yeah. Oh boy. I've come to the end of my line. Oh, I thought it said life. Well, wow. that's essentially what it is, though, I think. With these final steps, I take back my freedom, unchain the shackles that never could have held, that never could hold my mind. Time keeps running and running, outstripping the dead, tired ones. The hours will run out from all of us. And in the end, no one differs from the other. Only the blue sky and the green grass go on forever in this world, where seconds feel like eternity and years pass in the blink of an eye. Holy <laughs> shit. I was thinking about that concept just the other day. Seconds can feel so short and then years just fly freaking by. When the last rays of light set behind the shores, night wraps us in the blanket and leads my way to the stars. Why don't you go ahead because it looks like it hit you in a pretty particular way. Ah, right, go ahead. When the last rays of light set behind the shores, night wraps me in its blanket and takes my way to the stars. Through the fear and the ache, past the storm and the rain, I have made peace with the world. I am born again. I may be gone in the flesh, but my love will stay here and I am always with you in spirit. So just stay strong. No one wins tonight. No one gets a closure. No one walks away victorious. But don't forget me. Burn a candle for me when you can. Oh my God. That's a beautiful song. And also sad. It's a, like a remembrance song in a way. But I mean, I don't know what you want to, I, Yeah, it's just... I talk about it a lot. I'm starting to forget what my mom sounded like. Or what she looked like. Then I'm like, Gotta list all these people that you know, I have forgotten, like on a daily basis. But you know, you gotta live, man. And I got a whole room full of ghosts that I sit with a lot. It's crazy to me, like inches can change like an entire family. It's tough, it's tough. I got, I got a friend that, he just had a kid, but he was on a trip when he had the kid. And he wouldn't let his, uh, He wouldn't let his girls send him a picture of the kid because he said, I want to see him like when I see him. Yeah, man. You know, like, uh, you know, 
folks weren't able to come through for him, you know, so. Well, he never got to meet his kid, and his kid never met him. And his kid's gonna forget him. That's uh, yeah, but like, I don't know. It's tough because I feel I feel bad, you know, because like I've had I've had a couple I've had a lot of losses, so it's like. feel bad you know listening to the song it's like part of survivor's guilt is like that person pops in your mind after or whatever and you realize you hadn't thought about them for months you feel terrible but i mean what can you do it is what it is um Yeah, I, I just, that's a tough part, is I'm like not able to keep all these, people around, I don't let, it, let any of those people go, I don't think, Yeah. especially that guy. Yeah, it's a good song, man. You know, sorry, this is what it is. I don't really have a lot, you know, else to say about it. It's a good song. It's a silent count for me, obviously. Yeah. The the song was Ben, you pick a lot of songs that end up like kind of giving me like a soundtrack to to think. I, that probably sounds so odd, but um I find that maybe because like my mind is busy, it's hard to find time to like really like stop and think about things that I I don't know. But anyway, that as the song is playing, like I have this all this stuff running through my head that I'm like piecing out and figuring out, and then obviously there's prayer involved and stuff. I don't know. It's just like the song itself was like a, a platform for a lot of things. I think for me, and then certainly obviously for you. Um, I know for someone, like sometimes I wish that they had more, you know, books or information on like how, and maybe that's how AI will help us in the future or something, but like, you know, like you have, you've experienced so much loss and I've essentially not experienced any in a way. Like the miscarriage that I went through feels to me in my heart something completely different than losing, um, somebody that I've had a whole person w with and it's different in that I think that it has its it has pain in different ways and ways that even like I think that it's deeper in some ways and then not as painful in other ways I guess just depending on how you look at it but I, I wish that there was more information like because I, I like you've been through so much and I haven't really been through all of that so like I wonder those things sometimes when I think about it, like where you are, what's going on with it. Um, that was, I'll tell you that later. Anyway, I'm going to give us an asylum count as well. It's a good song. Yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't avoid those. I mean, they're, they're bad subject. I hate, I hate bringing people down, but at the same time, like, I don't want people to feel like they're alone. You know, we don't need to pull out our resumes, you know. I, the, I saw the effect that miscarriage had, had on me, so. I mean. That fucked you up for a lot of years. Loss is a loss. You know, so.
Yeah, I understand, you know, dudes dudes get tattoos and some shit for their people. Mm -hmm. I don't do it because I don't like to get snuck up on. So changing the shit, see somebody's name or whatever. Plus, <laughs> I wouldn't have any space less so all the people that are fucking lost. Let me talk about this. Anyway, you say whatever you're supposed to say. Oh, he knew what he was doing. He died doing what he wanted to do. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Sure, that works for his son. Hey, man, he died doing what he wanted to do. So. Anyway, I'm out of this review. We got one more song left, dear listener. I think you're right, Controller Minds. I think it is Insomnia. Got one more song. It's probably we'll Insomnia. Back. We'll be back on the other side of the break. Vin out. Sorry, out. Go.